Here's an Amazon Fire Max 11 tablet. I'm going to show you how to transfer or copy photos and videos directly from the tablet to your Apple computer, MacBook, iMac via cable. So first thing is go ahead and connect to your cable. The cable that comes with the uh, this tablet is a USB-A to USB-C. The thing is I don't have a USB um, a USB-A on my MacBook here, so I had to use another cable, a USB-C to USB-C because I only have USB connections here. Okay, so let me connect one to my MacBook. So I just connected to my laptop, my uh, my MacBook here, but also in order the way I do it to transfer my photos and videos is I download this Android file transfer. It's a free download. I downloaded this like six years ago, and then once you download it and install it, it's going to show up as a little Android guy down down here. So now. Every time you know you have your tablet or any other like Android phone or whatnot. So now I'm gonna go ahead and connect it, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. Okay, another thing pops up, don't worry about it. Let's go ahead and sign in. Okay, so I'm signed in. Sometimes you'll get a message saying like allow this computer, or you'll get it like a message here. If you do, just look at both devices here. Let me just click on OK there. And now I'm going to go back down here. We're connected. I'm going to click on that little green Android guy. I'm going to click on OK right there. Oops. It's not going to work yet, okay? Because you have, first you got to slow, slide down the notifications here. Slide it down. And it says right here, system, charging the, uh, this device via USB. So tap this little down arrow. And then tap right here. It says tap for other USB options. Tap right there. And you got it. See, by default, it's on no data transfer. You need to tap up here, file transfer. Okay, and voila, this up here pops up right away. If this doesn't, this window doesn't pop up, just go back to the little Android guy, click it, and this will pop up. And now from here, what you have to do. So we're in my tablet now. You have to go to the DCIM folder. That's where all your photos and videos that you've taken. So I'm going to double click DCIM folder, and then you have camera right here. Double click on camera. And I only have like three photos and one video here that I've taken so far, okay? So I know it's a video because this is MP4. So from here, you can go ahead and save it right to your MacBook or your Apple computer. For instance, if you wanted to um, copy this photo to your laptop or your computer, Apple computer, you can just drag and drop it on the desktop right there. And you can see it right here. Or what I typically do is I'll go on my desktop or empty space here and I'll right click or I'll click and then I'll create a new folder here and I'll call this one Max. And then what I typically do is I just copy all of these and I'll drag and drop it into my Max folder right there. Let it go. Okay, it looks like it's done. So from here, you can go ahead and you can disconnect now because it's already saved to my MacBook here. So that little folder called Max right here, I'll double click on that. And you can see the photos and videos I had on there. And the video MP4, let me double click on that. This is just a uh, test video here. Anyway, there you guys go. You guys got the message. Questions or issues, just comment below. All right, good luck.